Hello there. Welcome to my channel. My name is Daniela, and here we talk about makeup and project panning. Today I'm bringing a update for the Panning Zoo Project Pan. Uh, this is a product I made in collaboration with the Fantastic Ladies, and it's all about animals. Just animal-themed makeup, skincare, anything beauty, however you can think of. Um, it can be animal-themed image, print, name, um, however you want to do it. So this is a short-term project, starting June 4th, going to October 4th, so one month left. And you work on six to eight items. Um, and let's go ahead. I, I do have one item rolling out, so uh, that's a good one. So first of all, we have this owl lip balm. It's not done yet, but it is very close to done. It's getting there to the bottom. I have finished like a quarter of it there. Um, there's pan. So as long as I remember to use it, I think I'll have it done by the finale. Next, we have the Drunk Elephant, the Bronzy Anti-Pollution Sunshine Drops. I really like these for mixing in with my sunscreen. Um, I wasn't using it as much in the last month, uh, but right now I've been using a new mineral sunscreen and that one does have a bit of a white cast, so I do have to use quite a bit of this. Um, not, not all the way to like a one-to-one -one ratio, but still quite a bit. Um, I used like 0.7 grams in the last month, but there's still a ways to go. Um, I have no clue where I am because this packaging is like thick, thick and white, so it's hard to tell. Um, but yeah, to make sure to shake it well. And yeah, sometimes it takes a few more shakes to get it out. So it's getting down, but I don't think I'll have it finished by the end of this project. Um, but I'll just keep using it with that sunscreen and then I'll eventually finish it. I would purchase it. Next we have the Aurelas Ambient Lighting Edit Unlocked Elephant Palette. This one is a very summer themed palette. I didn't really use it much this last month. I added only one use to everything except dim light, which I added two uses. Uh, my goal for this was to hit five uses in each um, of these face products. Uh, so I have three uses total, two, two, three, two, and four. Um, so I'm at least halfway there, uh, but I'll just need to remember to use it. And as long as I make sure to use it, I think I'll have it finished. Uh, my goal finished for the finale. Next, we have the Salt New York Beige Radiant Cream Highlight. So this looks like this. It is a single pan. There is a bit of a dip, kind of hard to tell. There's a sort of shallow dip. Um, but yeah, the thing is it, is, it is a bit more firm. So it does take quite a bit of use uh, to make the dip deeper. Um, I pretty much use this every single Day I'm in the office, and that is like 12 times max per month. Um, so maybe I'll be able to hit pan. I thought I'd be able to easily hit pan, but I see now that since it's firmer, it's a bit harder to hit pan, but I'll try. I'll probably try to hit uh, use it more than just when I'm in the office. I have this really nice uh, palette right now that I'm using in the office. Uh, 
uh, the highlight. I have this cream blush from uh, my Natasha Nona Love Glow palette. Um, this is very summery because it's like a darker pink, but it has like a gold shift. Um, so I'll probably swap it out later. And then I have a bronzer and I have this sort of like foundation concealer. Uh, next is the good update. This is from my ColourPop Bill Super Shock Shadow. Um, I was thinking about Bill as in like a duck bill. So I hit pan. <laughs> Apparently I was really close to pan because it only took me a one more use to hit pan. Um, and I used this three times total in this project. I did make sure to wear it evenly so I didn't just press down to the bottom um, and I enjoyed I enjoyed using it uh, I'll, I need to remember to keep using this um, even after this product also I forgot to mention that with this cream highlight I did use it six times in the past month so that's more than before because before that I'd used it five times so I've used this 11 times 11 times total and the last item I have here is from the iHeart Revolution Bugs Bunny palette um, I was working on the shade Lola and that's Bugs Bunny's girlfriend so it's another rabbit um, I passed it into this other palette uh, because and it wasn't really working in its original packaging. Um, so it's here. I don't have pan yet, but it is very malleable and I have a very good dip. Maybe one or two more uses and I can hit pan. Um, I'm very happy with that. And after that, I'll make sure to keep using it. Um, because if you have Ritz, which I got Ritz recently, it's a ColourPop Super Shark Shadow. A lot of people like it. I would say this is like the pink version of it. Um, so Ritz is kind of like a brown taupey base with silver glitter. This I would say is like a sheer pink base with with like silver pinkish glitter. Um, so yeah, it works really easily on the eyes. So that's it for this update. Um, only one more month left. I think as long as I make sure to use everything, which I mean I will because there's only one month left, I think I can hit almost all the goals. Um, I don't think I can finish the Drunk Elephant uh, drops and I'll make sure to use that highlight. Um, I really want to hit pan on it. Uh, if not, I'll get really close, but yeah. Anyways, thank you for watching. Uh, please subscribe, follow along my journey. I'll link my Instagram down below um, so you can see pictures on this update and see how my other projects are going. Thank you. Have a good day.